Avi here for Science and Swords again. So we've just gotten in our latest order from Global Gear, which includes the brand new uh, Scabbard for LARP Swords, which uh, is actually an item that a lot of people have been wanting because uh, generally getting around in Melbourne when you've got a fairly realistic looking weapon uh, on your lap, on the train, it's not a great look. Uh, it leads to a lot of panic in the general public. So we've got these fantastic back mounted scabbards. They've even got two shoulder straps so you can actually do it as a, a proper backpack. Let's just grab one of their random swords. So we've got a nice Battle Legends Viking here. And let's give it a... Yeah, that fits perfectly. That's nice. It fit over the shoulder well. Yeah, it fits over the shoulder well. Um, Ash, can you just pass me one of those swords? Let's try a different brand. Cool, so we've got the Calamacial Ninja. Yeah, that feels perfectly. So it's going to be a pretty good scabbard for anyone that needs just a, a quick, cheap and dirty way of, of getting their sword around. Let's, um, let's strap it on actually and see how it goes on the drawer. Nice, simple clips. Of course, I didn't bother to adjust the... Ah, now it's choking me. Adjust the thing, adjust the thing. Ah! Nice, simple, adjustable strap there. Right, let's try it now in less choking mode. Uh, I know some of you are into that, but you know it's still too early in the day for me. Ah, it's much better. Okay, so like all traditional back scabbards, drawing from it is actually an impossibility. Um, well, not an impossibility, just a pain in the ass. Uh, it does need to be pointed out that the idea of drawing from a back scabbard is actually a historical inaccuracy. Uh, they would usually draw from back frog or have some sort of quick release mechanism within the scabbard to make it click open. But if you need a way of getting your sword around on fields or in general public, uh, these new Global Gear scabbards are going to be quite good. And you know what? You'll probably actually be able to reclip them and even hip mount them, I reckon. Cool. Catch you later, guys.